Hi guys, in this video I'm going to tell you how to get into the Harvard Summer School. So first, you should be academically motivated student who graduate from high school in two, three years of time. But if you are an international student like me, you are good to go if you are in 10th or 11th grade. So the sec second thing is that you should apply early because Harvard Summer School starts in 20th June so you should apply in December or January and uh, if you are an international student you should start thinking about this as early as possible like in September or October because of the IELTS or TOEFL exam. Third thing is that think early about what course you will choose because there are over 200 courses in Harvard which can be seen at summer.harvard.edu, link down below. And choose the best one for you. You'll have two options. First is one eight credit course, and second option is two four credit courses. So two, two courses, four credits each. I have chosen the chemistry course with video you can see down below too. And uh, it was pretty hard one, I'll say, but of course I'm not regretting. And um, I would suggest to choose two courses for four credits, in total eight credits, right? Because then you'll have more free time, and more free time means more fun. Fourth thing is that you should go to summer.harvard.edu website and complete an online application with provided materials including conciliar report, transcripts and signed rules and regulations. All the blanks you can download from the address that you know, summer.harvard.edu. Then print everything and fill all the forms like that you can fill. After that go to your school, concealer or teacher and she will help you and uh, they will complete all the stuff that they need so don't worry about that after that go to your medical stuff doctor and ask them for your medical checkup after that you'll have the medical information and uh, also the application fee is fifty dollars which is non-refundable fifth thing is that you should write an essay on topic that you are passionate about. I wrote my essay about myself and places that I have been visiting and how the traveling affected us. If you are an international student like myself or your native language is not English, then you should pass the TOEFL or IELTS exam on mark 7 or higher. Also, you'll have the IELTS or TOEFL certificate sent in and then with all your applications, application materials, send the TOEFL certificate or IELTS with all your Harvard Summer School applications and track your letters to ensure that Harvard have received them. Check your inbox because you will receive a notice with your login and password to your Harvard Summer School profile to check your application status. Therefore, you will see what you need to do next or what is missing in your application materials or elsewhere. And then is the waiting time. You'll receive an email with congrats that you are in the Harvard Summer School program.
after that you have chosen the course that you already wanted, I suggest to think about living at the campus. I suggest living at the campus and eating at the Annenberg Hall because then you will have the full Harvard exper experience like a real Harvard University student. Because remember that the Harvard Summer School gives you the full Harvard University experience. Just in uh, Harvard student lives here and studies four years but you only have seven weeks like two months and uh, you're like legit Harvard University student even the student ID is the same the real one after choosing everything you're all set also at Harvard there are a lot of dorm rooms and you can choose in which one you want to live and with whom everything is random but I promise you'll have the best roommates and the best dorm room because people at Harvard are awesome. Thank you for watching and you can ask me questions in the Facebook page, also in the comments down below and see you in the next video. Okay, I should go. Bye.